All right, so in this video, what I want to do is find the radius of the circle right here. So I'm going to draw a line through the middle, and I'm going to make the radius equal to the variable r. So r is what I want to find the value of. So how am I going to do this? Well, first, let me draw a line through this square. So I'm going to label this side length of the square B, this side A, and this side C. So we're going to be using the Pythagorean theorem to solve for C. Well, we already know that A is 2 and so is B. So I get 2 squared plus 2 squared is equal to C squared. 2 squared is 4. And again, 2 squared is 4, so I get 4 plus 4 is equal to c squared. And 4 plus 4 is 8, so I get 8 is equal to c squared, meaning the square root of 8 is equal to c. And the square root of 8, I can simplify this to the square root of 4 times 2, which is equal to 2 root 2. So 2 root 2 is equal to C. So let me put another circle, or sorry, another shape over here. And I'm going to write 2 root 2 as the side length for C. So now from here, we also know that if the end of the square to the middle is 2 root 2, then the middle to the end, this should also be 2 root 2. So we can say that the big diagonal, which is from the end to end, we can say that this is equal to 2 times 2 root 2 which is equal to 4 root 2. Now, what we want to do is just find the radius of the circle. So, to do that, the radius is this length right here, and this is 2 root 2. So to find the radius, what I'm going to do is find the length. This is, this is also the radius from here to here, and same with this. This is also the radius. So we, we can say that this is r because this is also the radius. And also, this length from here to here, this is the radius as well. So I have another triangle right here, and I can say that this is c. So this means that r squared plus r squared is equal to c squared. And this means that 2r squared is equal to c squared because I added like terms. And now if I take the square root on both sides, I get the square root of 2 times r is equal to c. So the square root of 2r is equal to c. So now from here, I can say that c is this is the radius. We have the box here, and c is going to be two root r. So from here, we can say that the big diagonal, which is the total thing, is we know that it's equal to 4 root 2, as we already stated. But it's also equal to 2 root 2 plus r plus square root of 2 times r. And this means that 
we can set these two equal to each other, meaning 4 root 2 is equal to 2 root 2 plus r plus square root of 2r. And I'm going to first start by subtracting 2 root 2 on both sides. So I get 2 root 2 is equal to r plus the square root of 2r. And if I factor out r from here, I get 2 root 2 is equal to r times 1 plus square root of 2. And now if I divide both sides by 1 plus square root of 2, these two cancel out, and I get r is equal to 2 root 2 over 1 plus the square root of 2. So this is my value of r.